Today I'm down in Memphis, Tennessee, exploring the riverbanks because it's been historically low the past year or two. Uh, it's kind of gone up a little bit now. It's been lower than it is, but we are down here out in the ri Wolf River section. And since we're in town, we're going to be checking a few spots, seeing if we can find any old bottles, anything history related. There's dead fish everywhere. These carps keep jumping in the boat. So if you guys like, uh, you know, videos like this, like, hey, look. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where'd your shoe go? My shoe. Oh, no. Oh. You stepped way too soon. I didn't think it would be. What you gonna do about that? Uh. All right, that's the end of this video. <laughs> Gosh, there's a bottle right, piece right there. What is this? A little ball? A clay marble? Who knows? It might be a marble. What do you think? Yeah, don't step right by. <laughs> yeah, you'll sink. <laughs> you'll sink. Or anyways, uh, yeah, feel free to watch this video. It's going to be a lot of walk in the banks. You never know what we're going to find, so uh, let's get at it. Now my foot is wet. Yeah, and they got one wet foot. Smell it! No. So first one to find a straight side Coke bottle wins. Okay. I highly doubt we're gonna find that. <laughs> Man, this is this town's known for like rock and roll, what jazz. It's like the birthplace of all of music. Really? From what I read. From what do you read it in? They've got the ninth largest pyramid in the world. Man, it's kind of treacherous. So it's an old train track. I guess this was probably used for delivering cargo. Stuff for trains. I guess the I don't think it went all the way across. I think the ships just came up and it. How old do you think the brakes are? It's like, it's like written on. Oh, look, there's coal everywhere. Oh, that is? Yeah. That's because you've been bad this year. It's coal. I found some coal. There's a. I don't know the honey hole spot, so we're just kind of going down. There's no honey hole spot. This one says AP Green Empire. Cool. Google it. I bet you it's something amazing. Is that glass? Yeah, there's coal everywhere. Makes it's me got think like patterns on it. The trains were hauling the coal. What do you think? Yeah, I'm getting by on the bottom of my shoe. Oh. oh. Don't you just wish you had it all inside your shoe? I do. I really do. I, for some reason, I just I just went with my gut and assumed it would hold me up. Never. But the water, I mean, we're standing where the water goes way up. Good. You found a bone? A rib, a T bone steak? Yep, T bone steak. I think you found one of those in New York. I did. Look eerily similar. Oh, what is this? White what? ceramic. It's part of a toilet. It says Gecko USA. Oh. Huh. Oh, there's more like white ceramic. Well, those old bottles, I mean, if you get in the right spot, I think we need to go closer to downtown. So I think a lot of people have already searched a lot of this. So we're kind of looking for the scraps, the secrets. Here's an old part of an old milk bottle. Man, there might just be goodies out here. Mm. Pretty, pretty sweet, man. Straight Never know what you'll bag. find. I know we don't have trash bags, so we're not like, our goal isn't to pick up trash. Sometimes it is. We're not really prepared. We're not, yeah, <laughs> it'd be full instantly. We're not really prepared for that today because this is kind of a last minute video. Well, here's most of a bottle, but still a screw top. Four fifths pint. Probably some what, whiskey? There's all these massive chunks of coal around here. I wonder if that's what they were transporting. I'm assuming. Well, that, that coal is everywhere. We got a tire right here. We haven't found any cars out here yet, but lots of fish, lots of tires. The water is still low though. I think it's still like 10 feet lower than kind of typical 10 or 11 feet. What do we have here? Not super old. It's a baggie. What does it say? It's a fire extinguisher cover. Interesting. 
probably off with these old barges down there that we already kind of explored. It's a lot of random metal and scrap. This is kind of the uh, industrial area, all these factories, at least they used to be. There's kind of no telling what you might find. Some old chains. I thought those were handcuffs for a second. Dang, what is that? That looks like part of an old. That's an old bone right there. That's a big old bone. Dang. I'm assuming that's animal. It's pretty large. Could be like a leg bone or something. It's crazy to see like the old pillars here from the dock. Whatever structure was here. Pretty wild. You can tell they just used old trees. They didn't even like cut them down that much. You can still see the knots and roots off of them. Ooh, this little jar here. Oh, that's a screw top. Got a nice little shape to it. I wonder what that was. Well, that's the first, I think, intact bottle I found. I love finding stuff like that. I like the smaller bottles for some reason. The bigger ones, you're, first of all, you're, you're going to be hard pressed to find, not broken. But something about the smaller ones is kind of cool. Oh snap, look at that. Oh, that's the top, top to a jug of something. Yeah, not surprised that's all that's left of that one. You can just imagine the workers sitting back out here and sitting on the railroad tracks and drinking and throwing bottles off in the water. And all these years later, someone like me comes around and finds them. Somebody call for a taxi? I feel like we could walk down this whole thing. Oh yeah. Oh, I see part of a toilet. I'm gonna park down here. Ooh, what is this thing? It's like an old, it's like an old crank. It says something on there. Cane or maybe? I wonder what that went to. Jeremy's finding a bunch of old bottles this way, he says. We got MF Memphis, Tennessee Coke bottle. There's tons of little old shards of bottles. When it comes to bottles, you know, you definitely want cork top or pop top. No no screws, and if you can find bubbles in the glass, that means it's really old. What are you finding? You got a straight side? Go farther down. Which way? This way? Where you came? Yeah, just imagine what's hidden and littered farther. Man, it stinks like fish in here. Two fish, and it, now it reeks. This little corner looks like kind of good. But... Here, look at this bottle. That's older. Look at the size of that dead fish. It's pretty beefy. Look at that yeah, one. That's old. I think the new plan will be see if we can just find a bottle. Oh, I found one. It just wasn't really An old. Old bottle. It wasn't super old. Dang. Look at that thing. There's, there's glass everywhere. That is an old bottle. Oh yeah. What is it called? The Prontal? Sure. This one says 13 on it. It's got a big bump. That was like a big jar. Mm. This is a good little spot. There's all types of ruins here and two big... There was some big... Something massive in concrete here. I don't, I don't know how I, how I know that. Ruins, eh? Just a guess. <laughs> I mean, it's going to be hard to find an intact bottle that hasn't been picked by someone. Memphis. That makes sense because that's where we are. Oh, that was like a little old. Really? This says patent applied. Somebody knows what that bottle got to. 
Send me an email. I want to see the picture of that. It's pretty blue glass. Oh, there's another part of it. We're finding parts and pieces. It's a mystery. I just found this. I don't know what it is, but there's air bubbles in there. So that might be older. It's got a pretty color. It's like thick too and like off. That's the bottom to an old, big old jug or something. There's all sorts of trash right near this structure. Ooh, what's that? Oh, I thought it would be complete. A little bottle with a triangle. Just love the, the colored ones. What we got here? It says KT and K SV China 273. Some old platter or something? old pots that's part of an old bottle man oh got some milk glass over here we're finding some more stuff oh here's some more of those that style so i like the milk glass this old white a lot of times it's like yeah, that's a lot of right around here was the spot people must sat up on the bridge or Oh, we got that might have been part of that platter. That looks older, I would say. I got some other stuff. This is definitely like a bottle dump site. Some pretty colors. Oh, I see. Is that a Coke bottle? What we got here? That one says Memphis. That one looks older, I would say. That's the first intact one I've, I've found. I have to hold on to that one. I just found this one. I don't know if that's there's some bubbles in that. It looks kind of straight, but there's a seam on there, so I don't think it's that old. I'm starting to find these little tiny bottles, which that's kind of what I like. Small little ends, cork tops. And this one says, this one's almost complete. It has one crack. It says, Chi Chess Bro Chess E B R O U G H. Man FG's company, New York. That's pretty cool. There's cool little, cool stuff everywhere. Well, I think we're gonna move down to the next spot. Oh. Some of these are pretty cool though. to collect a little pile here keep on rolling because we're losing sunlight quick oh that looks like part of that one almost check it out this is pretty cool if you look up there you can see it was an old barge that sunk and it's almost like completely gone but it's pretty incredible to look at that it's a huge chunk of metal 
what used to be a boat. I found a Coke bottle. I don't know, it looks kind of old. Yeah, this actually looks like a good spot. So somebody threw a big safe off the hill? I guess, I mean, it's super old. Man, I want to see the safe. What's back there? You can see it from here. The little one that says New York on it. I did find one, it wasn't broken, but it was an iron glue bottle from the 40s. Ah. I looked it up. The glue's so strong, it turns into iron? I didn't see the eye, so I was like, oh, look at it. What is that? Cognac. Uh, that's not, that's not old. I don't think it is. What was this? Memphis, Tennessee on the side. I bet that was a cool bottle. I don't know what it is though. It's amazing how much history and trash builds up. It becomes trash now. I still like some of the parts and pieces, but. Tip to a nice little cork bottle. What do you think? What do you think that was? Someone said Memphis, Tennessee on it. Looks straight. Does look straight. Who knows? Yeah, check out that old old barrel. What was in that barrel? What was in that? It's two broken straight side Coca-Cola bottles. Oh, that's a straight side? Coca-Cola. Oh. Uh, is that amber. part of it? Makes me sad. Those things are kind of a, a hot ticket. Yeah, that's a, the amber one's more valuable. Maybe I don't want to say yes. But We're know. not bottle experts. We We're just not bottle experts. we leave that to y'all watching. Yeah, they can write in the comments. Y'all are stupid. <laughs> uh, he left that there. That looks old cork top. Oh, it was a shoe. Shoe. Dang, is that like a that thing? How old is that? There's a bug in it. Looks like it's got nails in the bottom. It's old. That's old. That shoe. there's George Washington's shoe. No, his are made of wood. <laughs> Thought that was his don't teeth. You study? Don't, you, don't you remember? Yeah. Well, if you ever want to find really old pieces, yeah. Bottom, Come here for the pieces. Yeah. We're not looking for real old. I mean, if you put a bunch of them like in the display and melted them or put them in resin or something, that'd be cool. There's always something you can create if you put your mind to it. A homeless camp over here or something. Yeah, there's like some trash. There's an umbrella here. Perfectly good umbrella. Might have got rained out. Now that the rain stopped, there's a rearview mirror. It's a hat. A bunch of different random stuff. It's like someone dumped a trash bag out or something. What is that? King. Human air. Another Memphis, Tennessee. They all say Memphis, which is funny because we're definitely not in Memphis. Yep, no, it's a secret. What is this? This is old. <laughs> it's old. I actually should keep that. It's got a cool. So it has a five on it, like an old stamped five. Man, you can tell people like me, like, I got five. I own it. Eh? Five dollars, Buster. Is that a wine glass? Wine glass. Looks like it might have. I've had the bottom two old glass over here. Think that's what it is? Mm. It's kind of thick, but looks like the stem, maybe. 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 Who's drinking wine under this? that toilet wine. But wasn't this where that suitcase was? Did somebody take it? You gotta find that suitcase. Where 
I just found me a straight side Coke bottle. Look at those broke. It's they always break where you can see it says Coca-Cola, but they're always broken. A lot of rope cable here. Dang, look at all that rope. What a waste. Here, I got this for you. I don't want it, it's just depressing. It's like the third one we found. This is Coca-Cola on the bottom. Look how of, thick that glass is, dude. What a great find. There's like barely any Coke in that thing. <laughs> that was the way. That was the game. Oh, a bone. Oh. There's so much trash up on the banks here. I want to find a cannonball. I got cannonballs out here in Memphis. Yeah, I got one for you. Cannonball. What is that? It's a cannonball, man. Shit. Oh, it's an ornament. <laughs> I was expecting it to be like heavy glass. I mean, you want a cannonball, it's make believe. Man, it's my mixtape. I mean, you should re uh. We, try to we should fix it and see what's on try it. Try to see what's on it. Yeah. Some weird satanic stuff. Little, little baby bone. A little baby bone. What do you think? It's either. Uh, possum? Possum? Could be possum. Look at that. No bat. That could be good. Whatever it was, that was. That would have been really cool. That's like old clay or. Man. Some of the stuff laying around here would have been awesome. It's all smashed. That's, you think that's handmade? Sure looks like it. Hmm. You never know. They don't make them like that anymore, I know that much. No. Hey look, this one has a number six on it. You got a five and six? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but it says six. Did you keep the five? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Maybe that's part of it. That's a sign. What, I mean, yeah, I'll have to try to see if I can find what that means. I know, I'm just missing a few other numbers. What is that? Happy Meal toy. This spot's kind of cool because like, there's lots of old stuff, but some of the some of the modern stuff gets washed. Everything just kind of gets washed in this pit. And it's actually kind of clear over here, which is, which is interesting. And there's big old brick structures. Yeah, I can jump across. Gosh. I feel like I'm missing so many things just because it's hard to hard to see. This is impressive. I wonder if it got torn down or it just over time collapsed. Whatever this structure is. Oh, I found another phone. Found an old Motorola. What do we have here? Is it a computer? Oh, I found a drum pad. Akai Professional. It's funny. I haven't found one of those yet. And there's a big glass bottom. To an old jar. That thing's thick. That would have been a cool one to see in its entirety. Dang, this level's broken in half. Somebody was like, oh yeah, also a giant dead fish. Somebody could not get this level straight. <laughs> A lot of trash, a lot of junk. Pretty sad to see. What in the world? What is that? Oh, well, I should be wearing gloves for some of this stuff. Man, I found a big old bone. This one's old. It's like a hip bone. If you guys know, leave a comment. I just like, it's like, you find these bones all the time and you never really know. I don't know, I could be holding, could be, could be a human bone. Dang. 
Oh, that's not old. For a second, I thought it's like a new old, new old bottle. Like it looks like it would be an old cork top. And I found this weird bag, something's inside of it. And a ball. What? It's like a rubber glove, somebody put something in it. Open it. I don't want to open it, it might be fentanyl. It might be drugs. It probably is. I'll open it. Look at that. Well, that's the top of an insulator, I think. Alright. Maybe I found this weird, uh, something wrapped up. Oh, that looks like... It's like herbs or something in there. Let's just turn this down. Let's see what turn down for what? See something in here is gonna blow up in our face. We're both gonna mad at each. This is like seriously, somebody's gonna yell at us online for doing this because the whole fentanyl thing. Yeah, that's why I don't wanna. Well, it's wet, whatever it is. So actually, it's just another glove. Oh, well, probably don't want to touch that glove if they put it in the other glove. Yeah, we were really disgusting. I thought it was like drugs or something. No, uh, here, look. Here. No. Oh, I thought it was a team player here. Nah, nah. Right, check out this giant old, I guess it's like a winch or come along. Back when they had like the big ships over here. It's pretty, uh, pretty wild what time does to these, this old machinery and equipment. There's just, Pretty cool, honestly. I wish we had more time out here. This was sort of a last minute video. I'm all type of stuff. Yeah, we're out here uh, scanning for cars and the water's just been so low. It's kind of a, it's kind of a mess as far as cars. I know they found a bunch when the water was low, but it'll be a separate video, most likely of us searching for cars. So definitely subscribe to the channel. I uh, really appreciate that if you guys uh, want to help support us and see our other content. We try to do stuff like this too, but we do a lot of searching for missing people. And also, if you want to leave a like, maybe leave a comment if you feel like it. I always appreciate that. Uh, I know this video is kind of longer, so if you made it this far, thanks for watching. Alright man, you ready yet? where's all your stuff you found? Uh, I didn't keep it's anything. It's safe keeping, right? Yeah. Well, I found some stuff. I saved some of it over here. You found the number five. This video is brought to you by the number five. <laughs> I found a few cool things. My GoPro's about to die. But here's number five, number six, Coke bottle. I don't know how old it is, but it says Memphis, Tennessee. It's a cool little one. Chesboro something. And that looks like it might be a little old. I think that's old. Could be. It kind of uh, looks like an older design. But that's pretty cool. Thanks for watching. Check out Exploring with Nug. Subscribe to him if you want. If you want to be cool. And uh, we're going to keep searching. See you guys on the next one.